Okay, I just filmed the video. It's I introduced myself to you. But now it's actually time to tell you more why I was in the hospital. Actually, why I was in the hospital uh, between my uter uterus, the word here, and bladder had a cyst. How can I like? Mm, how can I say it? Mm. This is a type of uh, ba balloon filled with a fluid. Don't know which what thing, but it's a fluid inside, and it actually doesn't hurt if you don't do any like if you're not overwhelmed by I mean by working out by doing stuff that you can't so basically I had this in me growing and it wasn't okay that that's why I went to a lot of I was in a lot of like hospitals and on a lot of um, appointments that they realized what actually was in me and when they said that is a cyst they were like okay you're gonna get surgery so you're gonna come in on 11th of August yeah I did not film anything in the hospital because I was like okay it's me time I'm not gonna do anything with social network and actually I wasn't that much on my phone I could say okay the first day when I was like still feeling okay I was like yeah I'm gonna be on my phone whatever the next day on 12th of August I had surgery and actually I could say that after the surgery I was feeling pretty okay um I wasn't feeling sick, it wasn't really painful, nothing like that. So I was basically on my phone too, my parents came to check on me, they were like, oh my god, you're so, you're feeling good, that's what we love, and everything, so I was like, yeah, I hope that I'm gonna come home early, maybe tomorrow already. That didn't happen, but okay. So, when this happened, um, yeah, I felt pretty good and uh but i didn't eat uh because i had the anesthesia and yeah it wasn't really um appetizing to eat i wasn't really appetized or i could say i wasn't hungry okay so yeah about that and um i slept a lot that day like through a day probably slept for like three hours and then I had like a 30 or one hour break I was awake and then I sl still slept for like 30 minutes like I slept a lot which is good for anesthesia to basically give you the energy back then the 13th of August came or I could tell the hell of a day I'm, I'm serious Th this day it was hell and I'm not saying that because I need attention or anything, but, um, so, um, I wasn't eating on 13th of August. I wasn't feeling okay. Uh, while I was walking to a toilet, I fell unconscious and they had to come to, with a bed to back, to basically get me back into my room. So I wasn't eating, I wasn't feeling okay, I was feeling sick that I'm gonna, I, I, I literally thought that I'm gonna die that day, but I didn't, I survived. And the next day on 14th of August, I just woke up, I was okay, I was feeling yay, I, I could basically do anything yesterday, I was feeling amazing. So that, that that's that, and um, yeah, that's a thing that I wanted to talk to you guys. And um, I was eating my breakfast, I was eating my lunch, I was eating my dinner, I ate everything, I was feeling great. Yesterday, uh, also two of my friends came, so shout out to my to my good boy friends. They're not my boyfriend, but they're like my friend, and they're boy male friends, I'm gonna say like that. I don't have a boyfriend, I'm single by the way. But I'm not ready to mingle, because who needs a boyfriend? Don't, no. I'm done with that shit. Okay, so yeah, that's it. And today is the 15th of August and I'm finally, I just came home. 
I feel amazing. My stomach is still um not okay. Um cuz I still have stitches and it it looks disgusting, so I'm not going to show it to you. Um cuz you don't want to see that. Believe me, you 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 don't want to see that. So, yeah, here's this story time. I was in the hospital and um i can't currently do anything um i can sleep i can eat i can walk i can do like basic stuff i can't do anything sport related and i can't yeah basically i can't do anything i am a patient still so for like four weeks to six weeks next month uh, one month later, I will be able to start with my training sessions again, and I freaking can't wait. I can't wait to get back on the badminton court and play again and train and do stuff that I am able to, that I'm not able to do now. Uh, and by stuff, me go run, go, I don't know, dance, go party and do stuff that I currently can't. So, yeah. So that was all for this week's, I mean, that was all for this video, guys. I know that I filmed two videos in the same day, so my makeup looks the same, so don't hate, but I just have time to film a lot, so this video, guys, if you like, click a thumbs up, subscribe my channel down below, and click the notification bell that you're going to be notified when I upload a new video. And also uh, check out my social media down in the description box. And don't forget to go watch my other videos because they are great. See you in the next video guys. Bye.